So firstly going to take our sheet of puff pastry. I'm just going to place that down with the back on it. We're going to place our two pieces of thin short bacon across the centre of it. So this really is perfect for turning one meal into two. So we had Nanny Dee's meatloaf for tea yesterday and then we're going to make this one up tonight. So a different meal but the same ingredients. Just pop the meatloaf over the top of the bacon down the centre like this and then we're going to grab a beaten egg and a pastry brush. I'm going to cover the top of the meat with grated cheese of your choice and then I'm simply going to brush either side of the pastry and then just flop it over each other. So I've done one side, now I'm going to do the other side and then I'm simply going to fold that over onto the top like this. And that's really the easiest thing you have to do. Then I'm just going to put some more beaten egg over the top of that. I'm going to turn it over, do the same on the other side and then we're going to pop it onto a baking tray let's brush that top bit too very very quick and easy this one so please feel free to check out the meatloaf recipe that I loaded up this week on Nanny D's cooking hacks and then of course you've already got the main ingredient with this absolutely wonderful recipe. So there we go, a few air holes in the top. And then we're just going to pop her in the oven. So about 180 for 15 minutes. So this is what you're looking for. Absolutely delicious. Now we're going to cut it into slices. Like that. Sprinkle a bit of parsley over the top. And plate it up. So this really is an absolutely super tasty dish. Those three flavours, bacon, meatloaf and cheese, come together perfectly. Thanks for watching.